We need to stop using the term laughing gas. Nitrous oxide can be legally obtained in the UK and over the past year doctors are warning its use is becoming an epidemic as a rise in hospitalisations have been recorded. Those doctors include Dr David Nicholl, a neurologist at Samwell and West Birmingham Trust. My name's uh, Dr David Nicholl, consultant neurologist in Birmingham. Nitrous oxide, also known as NOS, is a colourless gas sold in canisters and is usually inhaled for a balloon. I mean, it's been around for well over 100 years. Um, people started using, and you may have seen these, the, the small little silver cylinders, but they're using increasing amounts. And so I've had patients using hundreds of these, and then they've moved on to these bigger ones. The term laughing gas is part of the problem because mm -hmm. that makes it sound like it's trivial, it's just a joke. And nitrous oxide is the correct term and that's what we should call it um, because it is a toxic substance. In fact, it's 300 times more toxic to the environment than carbon dioxide, okay? So it's bad for the environment. Unfortunately, people using it don't necessarily realize that. This stuff, which is pure nitrous oxide, which as I say is not for human consumption, you can get extreme meal from just lack of oxygen. Under the Psychoactive Substances Act of 2016, it is illegal to supply nitrous oxide for recreational use. Uh, then people make the assumption, I've heard this, is, well, okay, it is legal to use it. It's on sale in the shop around the corner, so why not? You know, I, th I think that is a challenge for us as a society is actually, why are we not enforcing the existing legislation? So the manufacturers are saying there should be tighter regulation of this. Stigmatizing users is the wrong approach. On the other hand, a robust approach to the suppliers who are absolutely targeting our young people and directly leading to neurological eye. It is actually a challenge for us as a society to stop using the word laughing gas because I think that trivializes it. Whereas I think to see you and say, well, would you like some nitrous oxide? I suspect yeah. you probably would hesitate. Whereas the term laughing gas just makes it uh, more trivial.